only way I'm taller than most of the volleyball players. For once I'm looking, for once they're looking up at me. I tell you what, I could not be more proud of these young ladies. Coach Hamley, Jen, I don't know where David is, but I'm gonna tell you, I've been doing this for 26 years. Win or lose, I could not be more proud of these young ladies. I really could. Unfortunately, I couldn't be in San Antonio, and I love the city of San Antonio, and there would be no better reason to be there than support these young ladies. I had several commitments in Chicago that I could not get out of, but the reason I'm telling you that is because the city of Chicago was absolutely lit up about what was going on over these young ladies and this coaching staff, and they captivated the city, they captivated the state, and they certainly wear Illinois across their chest. But I, like I said, I've been involved in athletics for a long time. I've never seen a team struggle. Every time you're on the edge of your seat, you know, edge of your seat, uh, Thursday night, uh, that last uh, match point, which was on Sports Center the next day. But, but that's just a snippet of all the wonderful things that they did. And I couldn't be more proud of uh, Colleen, Michelle. Uh, I know that uh, we would try to find another year of eligibility somewhere along the way for them. We are going to miss them greatly. Let's give those two a nice hand. And here is Rachel. Did I miss Rachel? Rachel, raise your hand. And Rachel. Yeah. Where's Hannah? Well, oh, I'm sorry. I'm striking out. Okay, I'm two for four. Fifty percent. Um, anyway, for those four that are leaving us, you'll always be heart of our hearts. And someone had asked me today uh, uh, about the volleyball program and winning championships. And I said, you know, if we have to do another uh, addition uh, for trophy cases at the BFL, knowing what's going to uh, in line for our future with Kevin and these young ladies, I couldn't be more excited. And uh, this season, we've had a lot of great things happen so far uh, across the board with all of our programs, but nothing like what's happened here. And I just want to thank them for all that they've done, not just on the volleyball court, but in the classroom, in the community. This is a, a group of special young ladies. And you know, 50 years from now, everyone's going to be talking about this team. And they've really uh, left an imprint uh, uh, on us uh, in so many ways. And I want to congratulate them once again and uh, wish them the best, uh, uh, those that are leaving us and those that are coming back. I know that we have a lot of volleyball play and a lot of national championships to win. So let's give them another nice round of applause. Thank you. Okay, I'm going to introduce the best volleyball coach in the country. Let's hear it for Coach Manning. And I don't know, you know, Coach Hamlin, this guy, I'll tell you what, uh, he's a special guy. I don't know if it's the California thing or anyway, but he, you never see this guy sweat. I never see this guy sweat. And uh, I, as much coffee as he drinks, I would think you'd see him at least jiggle once in a while. But this guy, Coach Hamlin, you can tell uh, just the kind of person he is and the response he gets from his student athletes and the way they perform. That's a credit to him and his staff. And I want to thank Kevin, I want to thank Mary, I want to thank his, his uh, wife and, and kids, and, uh, and I think uh, Kevin's in-laws, they might have had the toughest job babysitting um, for the last couple of days, but Coach Hamley is a special guy, and I'm going to tell you, Coach Hamley's going to be coaching at the University of Illinois for a heck of a long time, and we're happy to have him. Thank you. Uh, first, let me say thank you guys for coming out here. And greeting us, this is special, you know. And um, thank you for the support that you guys have shown throughout the whole year. It was overwhelming this year, the amount of support that you guys have shown to the team, and not not just the Illini here in Champaign, but across the country, the the emails and the texts and the I mean, it was it was just pouring in from all across the country, and that's truly special. Uh, and I, you know, I, I don't, I, I know we as a team that we wish that we would have brought home the different trophy, the one with the gold plate instead of the silver plate on it. But uh, when we, we get a chance to reflect on this, and it's hard to do now, to be perfectly honest, I know that we'll look back and just remember how special this year was. And not because we finished, to me it's not because we finished second place or went to the national championship. It's because of how these people operated every single day and, and how, that, how much they cared about each other and how much they loved each other and how hard they worked. And I don't know, there's no way, sorry, Clay. I'm a little nervous, so I'm throwing your head here. Take it, take it. Uh, but 
you guys, only a, only a few of you guys get to see behind the curtain and how much these guys and how hard these guys work to be not only great players, but great people and great students. And to be around this group of people, it's, it's truly special. And that's what I will remember from this is the journey, not just the destination. And so thank you guys again for all your support. And, and Colleen's gonna say a few words to you. Thank you. 